Good morning. This is Bonna Borlier with our Transformed by Faith Today podcast. We continue with the theme, Daring to Hope, and our scripture today is Jeremiah 17, verses 7 through 8, which reads, But blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord, whose confidence is in him. They will be like a tree planted by the water that sends out its roots by the stream. It does not fear when heat comes. Its leaves are always green. It has no worries in a year of drought and never fails to bear fruit. In verse 7, where Jeremiah says, But blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord, whose confidence is in him, is Jeremiah expressing the hope and blessings that will come from keeping a faithful and trusting heart. And he describes what those will be in verse 8. I know that for many of us, it has been hard to keep a faithful and trusting heart during the pandemic. It's been easy to lose hope and not be able to see how we are going to get through this. The struggle is real, and I get that. And it's okay to say that out loud. It is okay to express how you feel. Our feelings are valid, but it's just as important to not allow ourselves to stay in the negativity forever. We are in a tough season right now, but it is changing and will continue to do so. We need to cling tight to the Lord and our faith because he will not forsake us. He did not forsake the people of Judah. He did eventually bring them out of exile. We are just in a season of change. And yes, it's uncomfortable, scary, and frustrating, but the Lord will see us through. One thing I've learned during the pandemic is that I have more strength than I knew, and that has only come through my continued faith in Him and my prayer life. I've had moments of struggle, but I've persevered because of my belief in the Lord and His promises. It's been a been a pandemic of challenges. I've lost several loved ones. My mother was hospitalized with COVID and I had surgery on my shoulder. Those events could have made it easy for me to say enough is enough and walk away from God. But that's what Satan wants. He wants us disconnected from God so that he can get a foot in the door of our hearts. I know none of us want that to happen. Even when it's the hardest to do, let's remain faithful and believing disciples of Christ. Let's stand with our feet firmly planted planted on the ground, knowing and believing that our roots are growing towards the source of the living water. Let us know that no amount of heat will harm us and that we will continue to thrive and grow because of him. If today is a day of struggle for you, Try taking a minute to go outside and stand in the grass barefooted, imagining your roots growing into the ground. Stand there for a moment and just breathe, allowing God to fill you up with whatever it is that you need today. Will you pray with me? Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for this day. I thank you for your love and grace. In this season of change, help us to stay true to you, Lord. Remind us that you will not forsake us and that you are not blind to our pain. Dear God, hold us close to you, renewing our body and spirit. I ask that you please bless all who hear this message. Please keep us healthy and safe. In your holy and glorious name I pray. Amen.